In this video, I'm gonna show you how to take the perfect trainer profile picture with your Pokemon standing still. Cause oftentimes you'd be like, you throw your Pokemon out like this and like, ah, oh, he's facing the wrong direction. And the moment you move, they're like, they move too. So you try to get your trainer pick and they're just moving all the time. There is a feature added in the Indigo Disc DLC that actually makes them stand still. So for example, I want him facing me. He's not facing me right now. So what I'm gonna do is get him to go here. And then as I go here, if I press left stick, it actually forces him to stop but he stopped the wrong angle. So I'm gonna try and get him to, to come like this. And then I'm gonna stop him like this. And you'll see he stops right where he is right now, just like that. You press left stick in while he's out. This will stop your Pokemon right in their tracks. And you can see at the bottom left of my screen, there's like a hand icon that says like, stop. That means like, literally I'll walk around. They'll just stay there. They'll stay right there. So you can take any kind of photo you want. You can like, you know, get right up in personal and take a photo. But the whole point of this is for your trainer icon because the trainer icon photo is, is kind of tricky to, to grab, right? So I'm going to be about this distance from here. You have to open up your map. Then you're going to press X and you're going to go into your profile. And then from your profile, you'll see here, I've already got like a nice cool profile picture updated here from this exact system. Then you press plus to change photo. You're going to change your trainer icon. Now the trainer icon is actually the thing players see when they interact with you or they see you in multiplayer. So this is something you want to upgrade because so many people walk around with the defaults and it kind of looks not that interesting if I'm if I'm honest like you know make it something interesting. Use it like your favorite shiny pokemon, your favorite pokemon, just something different from the default. Like go ahead and change it. And when we go ahead and we select take a new photo, you'll see here it now gives us the frame here and the pokemon's far away because before it used to be like your Pokemon would stand next to you and they'd be invisible and it would be like impossible. But like, I mean, this one actually works nicely. But for your own Pokemon, you want to try get the perfect distance and by using that little stop feature so that your Pokemon stops in the exact place that you tell them to stop, it works great. So for example, I'm going to get my Greninja, my shiny Greninja who's done a lot of work and I'm going to take a photo of him just like this. You can see right now my photo is actually of Lucario, the top left of the screen. I was super proud of it until they gave everybody a free shiny Lucario. I still think shiny Lucario is freaking awesome, but it doesn't feel as special anymore because everybody has one now. So I'm going to use my shiny Greninja instead as my new profile picture. As you can see, boom, there we go. That's my new profile picture. All you got to do is find the right background and you're good to go. Now, in case this feature for some reason isn't unlocked for you, I only found out about it because I went to a Poke Center in Paldea. So if I go ahead and I open up the map and I press one of the R or the L key to swap to the other maps, you'll see Paldea region. And I just went to Medali, for example, just this Poke like, you know, center right here. And the first time I actually got the tip was by healing my Pokemon by this girl over here. And she said, by the way, uh, press left stick if you want your Pokemon to like stop. So when you have your Pokemon out, you just left stick and boom, stop. That's, that, that's where I learned it, and it is perfect for taking any kinds of photos that you want. I hope you guys enjoyed this information, and thank you so much for watching.